Hi guys, this is lecture 5.3, Optimization Problems Involving Exponential Function. We're going to go straight into example 1 from the learning resources. The effectiveness of studying for an exam depends on how many hours a student studies. Some experiment shows that the effectiveness, E, is to put on a scale of 0 to 10. Then we will have the function e t equals to 0 0.5 times in bracket 10 plus t times e to the power of negative t over 20, where t is the number of hours spent studying for an examination. If a student has up to 30 hours for study, how many hours are needed for the maximum effectiveness? So we know that the most that a student can study is 30 hours. Therefore, the domain for t will be equal to, sorry, will be in between 0 to 30. First, we have to find the critical points by determining the derivative of e of t. And that will be equal to 0 0.5 times e to the power of negative t over 20 times in bracket 1 minus t over 20. In order to find the critical points, we have to make the derivative of e of t equal to 0. When we do that, t will be equal to 20, and 20 will be the only critical number. To determine the maximum effectiveness, we have to use the procedure that we have used before to find the maximum value. We know that the only critical point is e of 20, so we have to find the y value corresponding to 20. But above that, we also have to check the endpoints, which would be 0 and 30. When we find the y value, we see that the y value for 0 will be equal to 5, for 20 is 8.7, and for 30 it will be 8.3. Obviously, 8.7 is the largest y value, therefore the maximum effectiveness measures of 8.7 is achieved when a student studies 20 hours for the exam. So that's the end of this lecture. Thank you guys for watching. Remember to do your activity as well as your assignment and upload them for your teacher to mark. And I'll see you guys next time.